Hey guys, what up? Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm yeah. actually reviewing the mushroom coffee mix uh, by Four Sigmatic in uh, the blend of Think with Lion's Mane and Chaga. So if you guys have heard of shroom coffee, you know it's kind of like a blooming thing right now. Everybody's talking about like shroom coffee, mushroom coffee. So I know when you first hear that, you kind of get these like negative connotations in your head of like shrooms and mushrooms, but it's not that kind of mushroom at all. It's a totally different kind. You don't have trips or, you know, see things after drinking this. So that's good. So for me, I was looking for a coffee substitute that wasn't going to give me jitters by the end of the day or keep me hooked and addicted where, you know, after three or four days of drinking it, I'm like, I need coffee. So um, a little bit of background for me, I've been drinking coffee since I was like eight. In our household, we drank coffee with like 10 packs of sugar and like six or seven creamers. Like that was the way to have coffee. So it was like sweet and kind of tasted a little bit like horchata with like a coffee hint behind it. Fast forward till now, I've been having like a packed schedule. I've been having events and studio sessions and I just want something that would keep me awake without drying out my voice, something that would keep me awake without, like I said, having those crashes and stuff. Now, right off the bat, kind of like a first impression, when I smell it, it automatically has like that coffee scent to it. Like it smells like coffee. You kind of get that aroma. I was telling my friend it almost smells kind of like diner coffee where it's like almost on the borderline of like being burnt, <laughs> but it still kind of has that kind of um, coffee scent to it. It's weird, but when you drink it, it, it actually kind of tastes like coffee as well. And I know that seems kind of weird, like, okay, yeah, it's supposed to. But honestly, like, it does taste like coffee. I was, like, reading review after review on this, and so many people were saying that they were so shocked how this mushroom tastes just like coffee. Now, one of the things that I thought was interesting was when I added, because um, I've been trying it kind of on and off throughout the past, like, week and a half, um, when I added, like, things like creamer to it, um, I did, like, a non-dairy creamer, I did, um, like, a coconut milk, I added that as my creamer, and um, when I added those things to it, or sugar, it almost takes on the taste of like a very, very dark, like black tea. And then I've tried uh, today, this one has the cacao powder in it, which I love. Uh, I feel like it gives a certain depth to it that regular coffee has, whereas this almost tastes like a very like medium to light type of roast. Um, so if you're definitely like, I like my coffee dark, I like it black, you know, then uh, this might not be the product for you, but I would still suggest maybe you try it and see if you like it or not. Now, when I first drank this, I was very much kind of like, okay, I don't feel like a crazy energy boost that you do when you drink like energy drinks or coffee. Um, this kind of gives you more of like a balanced kind of like I'm stable and I'm ready to get work done and I'm focused. Now, how much are they? So um, these on their actual website, on the Four Sigmatic website, they're $14.99 per box. Let me show you what they look like. But you get 10 of these cute little packets in a box but what I actually ended up doing is I went on Amazon's website and um, they um, have a Four Sigmatic store there and they were having a special where um, if you bought from there and they had like a special I think it was a 20% uh, off coupon and my box was like around $11, nine, $11, $12, something like that. And also they have a discount if you get a subscription where you get the box sent to you like monthly or bi-monthly or whatever um, that you get another discount as well. So if you're kind of interested in that, that's something to check out as well um, if you know you're going to be drinking a lot of it. For me, I just kind of need a pick-me-up every now and then. I don't want to be drinking coffee like every day. But the thing that I like about this is since there is a little bit of coffee in it, it's essentially like instant coffee. It is really, really quick and out the door. I can make this without having a coffee machine and filters and all that crap at my house. So it definitely is convenient if you have a smaller apartment and you don't have to, um, and you don't have a bunch of appliances um, to be able to make, you know, smoothies and coffee and everything else. So you do like seven ounces of warm water, then you just mix in the packet, and then they kind of have suggestions that you can mix in to kind of enhance the flavors. So butter is one of them, which um, I thought was kind of weird. Uh, cacao powder and uh, coconut oil. So this was actually the first product that I bought and tried of theirs. I haven't tried the other ones yet, but I'll tell you a little bit about those. They have a mushroom elixir, which is kind of like the uh, chaga, I think, or um, the reishi mushroom. And it's pretty much just like a powdered extract, I think, that you can add to like smoothies and, you know, different sorts of beverages. Another thing, they have a, a hot chocolate, or that's what I'm calling, it's a hot chocolate, but it's a, a mushroom cacao uh, blend where you pretty much put it in and it's uh, cacao with the mushroom and it kind of tastes like hot chocolate which is kind of cool. So what about if you have allergies or you're on a certain diet? Well this stuff is actually a uh, vegan, paleo, non-GMO, um, gluten-free and sugar-free. So no matter what diet you know you're on I'm pretty sure that this will probably fit into it as opposed to like you having coffee with like creamer or different types of sugars and stuff like that. 
When I did put sugars in this, I used either raw sugar or like the rock sugar um, from Tivana that's supposed to like enhance the flavor and not just like knock it out. For me, did this work for me? I would say it did, but when I first drank it, I was expecting like a huge spike like in my energy. I expected like to be jumping out of my seat, like super, super energized, like high energy, way up there, and it wasn't that at all. I just felt like, you know, more focused and like definitely more balanced. So that's what the product says it's supposed to do. It's supposed to balance you out. Um, I would definitely say that it works, but when you drink it, it's so light that you don't get that bite at the end that you get with regular coffee. So that's what I really liked about it um, as well. There's a lot of people that weren't really coffee drinkers that had reviews that said like, hey, I can actually drink this black without having to add stuff to it and I'm fine. I don't get that bitterness at the end that you that I get with regular coffee. So I thought that was really interesting as well. So if you're looking for a product to try out, I would suggest, you know, checking this out, seeing how you like it, um, checking out the Four Sigmatic website and their other products. If any of you guys have tried this, um, you know, comment below. Let me know which ones you've tried. Let me know how they worked for you or, uh, you know, if you have any other questions about these specific products. Um, so like this video if you want to see more. I'll be posting more as usual and I'll yeah. see you guys later. Bye.